Hello, I'm back. This is part 49 of my playthrough of Dark Souls Prepare to Die edition, and I forgot to try and not take damage on the fall. Just immediately heal. So this part is probably going to consist of many, many Gravelord Nito attempts. Don't know how else to deal with this asshole. What? Why am I not hitting him? Okay, he's gonna do his explosion, which should kill pretty much all of these guys. But I need to heal. Okay. What's he doing? Big thrust. There's definitely gotta be some sort of strategy for this. Ah! God, these skeletons! Seriously. Oh, he's screaming. He's putting his sword through the ground. Ah. I'm almost out of healing. Oh, I'm dead anyways. This is just too chaotic. I don't know what to do. You got these skeletons that will roll at me at 50 miles an hour. You got those big guys that can dash. God. All right. Be back. Something's going on with my controller where I am holding down the sprint button and it's not sprinting. This is kind of a problem. It just randomly lets up on the sprint and then randomly goes back to sprinting and it's extremely, extremely annoying. Oh shit. Yep, these guys are coming. Holy crap. Maybe I can avoid aggroing those big skeletons. Unless that's not helpful. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh wow, I just completely lost control. That's. I just lost control completely and totally. Alright, well. The punishment for losing control of the situation and not being able to tell where all the skeletons are. All the half dozen skeletons, you know, you can't keep track of it. You get. Dot, you get killed, and your punishment is to run back, so that's what I'm gonna do.
took some unnecessary damage there, so I have to heal. Yeah, there's no way to do this without taking half your health and in damage. Oh, he's screaming already. Are you kidding me? That's just not even fair. Legitimately unfair. Hopefully I'll still be in the animation. Okay, good. Oh shit, I'm not in the animation this time. Ah! It's not like you can... Oh shit. So I just took so much damage there that that heal did nothing for me. <laughs> At least it'll hurt them. That's good. I just don't have enough healing. and I mean, I've, I haven't done anything to this boss and I've just had to heal a bunch of times. Oh, there's just so many enemies. Holy crap. Ah! Oh, he's exploding. And I got hit. That's no good. Oh, shoot. Exploding again? Ah, this guy still hit me. Oh, it's exploding already? <laughs> oh. oh, my God. So let's try this again. Gotta heal first because the fall will kill me. So I'll tr try this two more times and if I can't make any progress, oh my god. This might just kill me right now. I'm not dead somehow. Ah shit. So, yeah, I'm going to have to look this up if I don't make any progress soon. I'm going to get hit there. going to get hit again. Getting camped by skeletons. Just, just rolling after me constantly. They get back up after like three seconds. Not enough time to do anything. Just zoom after me. And then I get smacked by this guy. I have to heal again. Oh, here they come. Oh no, he's swinging. Swinging again. Alright, time to run.
forgot. Oh, how did he? I guess he was getting back up. Oh, he's blowing up again. I'm not gonna get out. Ah. Gotta heal like this. Oh no. Woo. Move. Stupid skeletons in the way. He's blowing up. Blowing up. Well, I've made some progress this time. But the problem is... I don't have enough healing. He's gonna blow up again. Move. Oh. Skeletons came out of nowhere that time. Okay, so I did make progress. So I'll just get back there and we'll try this again. Alright, so I died two times there just trying to get back. Bullshit both times. First time I died to the pinwheels because I got comboed and I just they just keep kept hitting me and I couldn't get out of the combo. And then the second time I just got kicked off the ledge. Fortunately, you always start this fight taking half your health and damage, so I've got to heal immediately. So let's see if he starts by screaming. If he does, I need to be able to backstab. Ah. Here he comes. Oh, what's he doing? Is that the explosion? Should be out of range. Yep. Why is he screaming when I'm right in range? Ah! Stupid skeletons come out of nowhere! And they're, then they're standing in the perfect spot to block me as well. So I got stuck. And now I gotta do that run again.
And it's not an easy run, let me tell you. So I'll be back with you in a moment. Screaming immediately, I might just die here. Okay. Whew. All right, these shitheads come. Ah. Backstab these guys. Wait for Grave Lord Nito to come. He's coming, right? Actually, he's not. Oh, shoot. If I aggro those big guys, I'm dead. Alright, here he comes. Ah! I thought I had it timed correctly. I'm trying to learn the timing on that. But it's tough. Alright, come on, Nito. Oh, there's the double swing. Whoops. Alright, let's run. Let's run. Oops, he's yelling. Gotta get over here. Ah, I got hit by that stupid skeleton. He's screaming again? Nope. God. Okay, don't hit me. Hit the skeletons. Oh, he's just yelling. Oh! That was stupid. Ah, that was a dumb mistake. How did I still get hit by that? Oh! Whoa! Well, this is gonna be the end of this attempt. Didn't know he could do that. Attempts I've done so far, but here's another one for you. Let's go. Here he comes. Just want to basically block these guys. Ah, shit! Come on! Dead! <laughs> oh my god. All that run. 
that I just did was for nothing. Let's try this again. Got a heal. Nito is coming. Need to engage him quicker this time. This is what I was trying to do, is just get some hits in. Whoa. Hit him once or twice. Ah, why can't I move? Couldn't move there. What is he doing? Nothing for the time. Oh! Come on! Okay. Now! Oh, he's blown up. Ah, shit, these assholes. I gotta heal. Oh, he's screaming again. I think I'm getting the timing down on that. What? I got lucky there. I was in the animation for the getting backstabbed. Okay, he's blown up again. He's almost dead. He's blown up again, I think. Okay, keep hitting him. Move back. Oh. Oh. How'd this guy not get hit? All right, he's dead. Ah. I'm telling you, man. These boss fights are hard, but when you beat them, it's just a sense of... of pleasure. Oh, and there's a bonfire right here. All right. My God, I got tingles right now, because that was... A rough set of, of of boss encounters and then running back. It was just so difficult. But I imagine if I ever do it again, it'll be a lot easier because I know what to do. I know not to run towards where Lord Nito begins because you got those big ass skeletons over there. And if you aggro them, you're screwed. I figured that out pretty easily, fortunately. Figured that out early on. All right, so I'm going to spend some of these souls or all of them, I guess. I can't do any reinforcing. No. Let's do some repairs. Oh, yeah, and I got that shield in the previous episode. I want to check that out. 
Let's see what that is all about. Forget what it was called. Effigy shield. Frightful Occult Shield defends against divine weapons and lightning. I know where that might be useful. Over in the Valley of the Drakes. An ill-fated plot to destroy the very gods. The followers of the occult once attempted to steal the power of Gravelord Nito, the first of the dead. So that's a lot of lightning resistance, almost 100%. So that's pretty good. I might find myself using that. So obviously not not in favor of the spider shield right now. So yeah. Might want to try buying another heal miracle if possible so I can have 10 heals. That might be worth it. Let's level up. Dexterity. One vitality, and I can still do one more. We'll do another vitality. Okay. So, my name is Einkro, and the adventures of Claudette Sim continue. We were able to defeat Grave Lord Nito and get the first Lord Soul that's needed to do whatever task uh, King Seeker Framps or Frappus or whatever his name was. I forget his name. Framps, I think. Whatever task he put us on. I don't quite remember what it was, but. We're going to continue doing it. See if there's anything else here. I think this is it. I just need to teleport out of here, basically. So I'll see you all in part 50 of this playthrough. This very long playthrough. It's a blind playthrough. So what do you expect? Yeah, there's nothing else here. I just got to teleport out. Giant Graves. I'll just warp to... What was the name of that place? The place underneath... Farling Shrine. I think you can warp directly there. Well, in any case, I'm just going to warp to Firelink Shrine, which is currently broken. Aw, Firekeeper's absent. So I'll see you all in the next episode.